Jamil Wagwan Jamaican Portmore stand up amazing to see another Yadi on the channel um, definitely stay tuned for this one reggae artist out of Portmore see you side soon so you know what I'm going through this list and I see Jamil on here reggae artist out of Portmore Jamaica Amazing to see this. Born August 30th, 1992, age 24. Record label, Quantanium Records. And uh, to be honest, after five minutes, before five minutes ago, I never knew Jamil. Uh, and I took a, one look at his, in his video, Gain the World, and I was instantly a fan. Mandam knows what's going on and he sees the lights. Looking at his locks. Quite um, the... I guess they're pretty intriguing. Um, look like they may be twisted, interlocked, but he does have them at quite the length with quite the styles going on. These here being braid locks down the side and to the back. But we've seen a lot of pictures um, with Jamil and his locks again here. Uh, we can see that he's very plentiful with them. Over 150 hands down. These look like they're being um, interlocked. They're so thin. Um, almost like the MGJ braid out here happening. Uh, I do like the look of the braid out here, especially when they, they go crinkly afterwards. Uh, we do see him holding down the braid locks. Um, in this case, the braid twists. Um, braid twists actually a lot easier to do than the lock itself. Probably a lot less damaging on the hair as well because it's not as tightly knit braids happening when you do this to your hair. Um, these, of course, being a difference uh, with the braid locks. Pretty sure these are called barrel twists. So you see him definitely using it a lot in his style. And of course, this is his hair out of the style. Um, just very plentiful, no really any tapers in the sides or nothing, um, just a lot of locks. It really reminds me of how my old set was and a lot of people out there desire to attain locks like this. Nothing wrong with wanting locks like this. Um, getting locks like this is actually easier than you think. All you really need to do is grow your hair out, go see a loctician or a salon, and they're going to twist it up for you. Go see your auntie or your sister. She's going to twist it up for you with some clips and some gel. Not the most recommended way that I would suggest to get dreads, but it is the way to do it if you want to look like Jamil. Um, <coughs> I do enjoy the way Jamil ties his hair up. Um, with locks being so thin and plentiful like he has it, it does make great dread buns. So I don't blame him for tying up his locks all the time, braiding them up all the time because that's what you do when you have locks of this texture because it's honestly very similar to this regular hair when it's at that length and at that width. It can do the same as whatever anyone else's hair can do. Curl, crinkle, perm, straighten. <laughs> Um, so I mean he has a lot of length and it's got to be at least you know he's pushing almost seven eight years with his hair being this long so it won't be more than unlikely that we do see another dreadlock journey come from Jamil because he's got the time to chop him off and start another lock set um, if he ever desired to do so Oh, serious. So I remember in the Movado video, um, this this photo popped up and it was Jamil beside him, uh, which is sick to see him now touring with Movado. Definitely on the rise and on the grind in the right direction, brethren. Um, so again, here with the twists and the braids, the braid locks happening. A little bit of a hair flip. And this video and this photo of his hair. Um, so he's definitely holding it down for the braid lock game. He's got more braid locks than Little Wayne that it really looks like. But as I do always say, be careful when you braid lock your hair so much because it does cause some 
damages such as receding hairline, um, balding, alopecia. It could also cause headaches. Um, yeah, just be careful. You don't want to pop in Advil or Tylenol too much from the braid locks because a lot of people die from those drugs every year. I'm not saying you're going to die from popping the Advil because your braids are too tight, but I just want you to know that weed doesn't kill nobody, but Tylenol and Advil kills people every year. Just put it out there. So really cool to see that uh, Jamil holding it down with the locks. Um, if you guys have any more Yardies in um, the list that you want to let me know to do a dread review on, put them in the comments down below because I actually do enjoy doing Jamaicans the most on the dread reviews. So I'm going to sign off here. Definitely go check out my daily vlog channel and also go check out the Not Nation Instagram page. Send me your photos. Get featured. This is Not Lock signing off. Peace out. One love. Not Nation salute. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace, my brothers and sisters.